Hi there. Welcome back to Synchro Modeler tutorial series. In this video, we are going to demo how to use horizontal slicing tool to subdivide your model. Let's use this peer as an example. To access slicing tools, we first have to switch to quantity takeoff view. Before we get into slicing, let's check out the property of this peer. Select this peer, click the info icon on the lower right, and you will see its volume and surface area showing on the side panel. Now, let's start slicing. Open the slice tools and select horizontally. First, select the element to slice. Then we can manually determine the cut length. For example, let's make a cut at this level here. This level is around 6 meters from the bottom, so let's put the number 6 in the distance field here. We can also check this box to reverse start point. That way, the distance will be measured from the top. Now let's hit slice and take a look at the properties of each subdivision. As you can see here, the bottom piece has a length of 6 meters while the top piece of 6.67 meters. We can also see the properties of the original or parent element. Now let's try multiple slicing. This time, we will take this peer as an example. We can select the peer and again, go to horizontal slicing tool. Make sure to select the multiple option. As you can see, with this tool, you can create multiple subdivisions of a same length. If we type 6 here, we get two 6 meter slices, and the top piece will take the remainder of the peer height. We can also try the reverse option, which will measure the length from the top. Now let's hit slice and check the properties. After slicing, we can still see the original element by turning on this toggle split screen here. You can see the original element in the right window its original properties will be available as well. When you're done, don't forget to synchronize your work to cloud by clicking this cloud button so the rest of your team can see your edits. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.